Welcome to place an existing field on multiple pages. Hey, I'm Eric. And in this video, I'm going to show you how you can take an existing field in Business Central and place it on multiple pages quick and easy with the simple object designer. So let's get to it. Here's the simple object designer. I've installed this from, from App Source. And I already have some fields added and, and put on pages, but now I'm going to take and a field that's already there and put it on on a page and i use the place fields function for that and now i get a list of all the fields in your business central or in this case in mine um, no matter if they're added from a from the base application or by another extension these are all the fields that are there so you filter on the table that you want to work with and i'm going to filter on the sales header. And you can see that there is a bunch of fields here. And let me find something. Let, let's, okay, let's say that that you're doing intercompany and it would be nice to have the intercompany IC partner uh, code shown. So in this case, I'll find field 125, the sell to IC partner code, and I wanna place that. So now I get a list of all the pages in the system where sales header is used. So we can see that we got sales code or the invoice credit memo. So let's do that and say, I will say add after, um, and let's find the, this, the sell to customer number. So right after that, we wanna see the intercompany uh, Um, IC partner code and I just you know F8 here and and I think that's fine for for purpose of this demo so the code or the invoice credit memo that's it so the field is added I close you see that this is placed on four pages now and the statistics was updated so now we have placed seven fields in total um, gonna hit publish and say yes so what is happening now is that the, the simple object designer is building an extension for you uh, with all the stuff we have. So the existing fields that we already added are still in there. Plus the now, in this case, the IC partner, sell to IC partner code field is added to four pages. Um, and this is deploying as I speak. So we can now go to extension management and, and take a look. These are all, all our extensions. And I can go to take a look at the deployment status and we can see that the top one says in progress. Uh, so I'll just hit a five. That one is now completed. So we're done. So let's go take a look at a, uh, at a sales order. And I will open up random sales order. Um, and we have actually here in the top because the number is, is hidden unless we do show more. So now we have the sell to IC partner code here. We can see that this code is by default not uh, enabled uh, in this case. And if we go to a sales invoice, We do the exact same thing. And we can see that the field is here. So in one easy operation, we added the same fields of four different places in uh, in Business Central by using the, the simple object designer. If you want to know more about it, you can visit hogart.com slash designer, uh, or you can simply grab the app in App Source and try it out yourself. Have fun.